What's up guys, Lewis Duran here again. Today I'm here to do my Christmas haul of 2017. Yes guys, I haven't done a Christmas haul since 2015 and I didn't do last year's because, you know, I didn't really feel like doing a, a haul last year. But now I'm here doing one for you guys because I got a pretty sweet Christmas haul. But I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I hope you guys spend time with family and friends. It's always fun to spend time with family members you haven't seen for a really long time. Hope you guys had that chance. Hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. Hope you guys got what you wanted. I saw a bunch of you guys um, pictures of your hauls. You guys got some pretty cool stuff. Can't wait to see your videos on them. But I'm pretty excited to do my video and show you guys what I got. So let's get right into it. First thing I'm going to show you guys some fruit snacks yeah no joke um i actually got some fruit snacks for christmas but yeah you guys already know i already ate them because i'm a fat ass yeah guys fruit snacks they're pretty good don't worry i'm gonna throw that bag away i'm not that weird guys next thing i got was some christmas money from my uncle pretty nice got 15 dollars right there pretty good christmas money Use that for G-Fest. This was an early Christmas gift from my mom she got me this cool walking with dinosaurs cup it's pretty cool. I like it. It's pretty cool for display. I'm not going to use it for drinking or anything. It says walking with dinosaurs right there. I'm not really sure what dinosaur this is right here. I think it's just a velociraptor, but then again, it looks like a T-Rex up here. Yeah, but it's pretty cool, though. It's pretty cool for display. Put that right there. Next thing I'm going to show off is some headphones. Yes, I listen to music a lot when I go to school or when I do schoolwork at school or when I'm just in the car or on my way to school. I listened to some music and I got some headphones for my mom. The headphones I got right now, they aren't loud enough, I guess. So, got some headphones for my mom. And from my dad, got um, some wireless wireless headphones, a uh, headset. I've seen a lot of people in my school wear these and I was like, wow, these those look pretty cool. So, I actually got some now. Put that right there. And another Christmas present from my dad. Um, got some speakers. To be honest, guys... I'm probably going to take this to G-Fest to walk around with some Godzilla music. That'll be pretty lit. <laughs> These are waterproof as well. Pretty cool speakers right there. Going to probably take that to G-Fest. All right, let's get into the Godzilla stuff. From my dad, he got me... Right here, he got me the uh, Gashapon set. You know, with uh, Burning Godzilla. Really nice. I already have Burning Godzilla. I got one from my Macaws a few years ago. Godzilla 1994 or just the Heisei Godzilla. I actually really like this one. This is actually pretty nicely detailed and the paint job is actually pretty cool. A blue burning Godzilla. A white crystal burning Godzilla. And a red burning Godzilla. This one is actually pretty funny to me because like the red paint job is really just Godzilla 1998. This is one of my favorites in the set. Showa Gigan. Pretty disappointing. The guy packed it up and the mouth broke off. So that's... Yeah, that's not good. Godzilla Jr. Showa Mechagodzilla. Or Mechagodzilla 1974. And Showa Anguirus. This one's actually really nice. So that was the set, guys. And from my dad again, he got me the Bandai 8-inch... King Caesar. This is a pretty cool figure. I thought it was a 6 inch one, but damn, it's the 8 inch one. So I got the 8 inch vintage King Caesar. Another Showa Kaiju in my collection. Starting to grow my Showa collection a little bit more, so this is really cool. It's really great to get things that you didn't ask for. Like, I, this was unexpected. I was like, whoa. It also came with uh, this little card saying thank you, and I think that's Japanese or Hong Kong. It says thanks. There's King Seesaw guys, I'll put him right there. From my sister, got a scarf. Because, uh, I got sick from this freaking cold air in Wisconsin, so I got sick and my sister hooked me up with a scarf, so that's pretty lit. Alright guys, now this is a story. Goji Franklin was on eBay one day. I joined his hangout with uh, Gorgira the Zilla and King Goji Fan 2002. He was on eBay. He saw this figure for $80, free shipping. <sighs> he added it to his cart, and I went straight to eBay that day, and I found it, and I asked my dad, hey, can you hook me up with this for Christmas, please? And surprisingly, he got it for me. Goji Franklin, I'm not really sure if you remember, but 
Yeah. I'll just show you guys the figure. I got the Bandai Museum Godzilla 1993. Oh my gosh, guys. This figure is amazing. Bandai Museum. Mint condition. There's nothing wrong with the tag. The tag is in mint condition. This figure is basically brand new. Oh, it's such an amazing figure. Goji Franklin, I'm sorry, man. Remember that one time, Goji Franklin, you checked to see if that figure was still in your cart on eBay? Sorry, man. I was the one that bought that figure. My dad was the one that bought it. Man, I'm sorry, Goji Franklin. I had to take that from you. Sorry, man. This figure is literally one of the rarest figures in my collection. If not... It has to be the rarest Godzilla figure in my collection. Guys, the figure is just beautiful. Take a look at the glitter. That Just just look at it. Uh, look at the glitter. The glitter is injected in the vinyl. It won't flake off. Um, there's gold glitter injected in the vinyl, which is really awesome. And this figure is all plain black vinyl. It's a little bit of translucent as well, so that's pretty cool. This figure is amazing. Bandai Museum. My first Bandai Museum figure. And it's my rarest Godzilla figure I own. Yeah, guys, what an amazing figure. $80, free shipping, what an amazing deal. But also, there's a set. There was two other figures that came with this figure from Bandai Museum. Red Burning Godzilla, I believe, and a pink Burning Godzilla, which was supposed to represent Meltdown Godzilla. Gotta get those now to complete the set. But this represents uh, Resurrection Godzilla from Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla 1993. Or, as some people know it as, Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla 2. This is when Godzilla dies and Rodan gives his power to Godzilla. And Godzilla gets up with all the glitter, you know, everywhere. Does his red atomic breath. This is what it's supposed to represent. This figure's amazing. I love it. So there's that. My sister got a cool camera. It's like an old kind of camera. It's like one of those cameras you take a picture with. And a picture comes out of the camera. It's really cool. I took this picture. Yeah, I took a picture of my... Bandai Museum Godzilla in front of my Christmas tree. Put that with Sharpie. December 25th, 2017. This is going to be really cool to look back on when I'm older. I'll put that right there with the Bandai Museum Godzilla. Alright, the next thing I got is pretty big. This is a drone, guys. A really cool drone. It comes with it, it comes with a camera. I can use this for, like, toy battles and stuff. And, like, if I do films in the future again, I can use it put that right there on the side you guys can kind of see the box so now here are the gifts my girlfriend got me yes my girlfriend got me some christmas gifts let me show them off to you first thing she got me was some headphones <laughs> she she knows i lose my headphones a lot and this one actually comes with a mic so i can actually use this these headphones for xbox because i play xbox one and i play call of duty 3 golden edition i can use this to talk to people though that's pretty cool so i'll use that thank you and without my girlfriend knowing, she got me the same Gashapon said. Yeah, she got me, you know, the same ones. <laughs> without her knowing though, so she got me this exact same set. So I'm not really sure if I need to show them off in the video. But I'm actually glad she got me the exact same set because now I have a Showa Gigan with the mouth and everything. So one that isn't broken. So I have one that's perfectly intact. I don't know if these are bootlegs. Can you guys please inform me on that? So yeah, my girlfriend got me the exact same set. I'm not really sure if I need to show it off, but thank you. My girlfriend and my girlfriend's mom also got me phone VR headset. Now this is pretty cool. I used this already. It's in the box. I just put it in the box for the video. I used it and it's really awesome. Uh -huh. You can play scary games on this. Really, really cool. I played some dinosaur games on it as well. It's really fun. You guys can see it right here. Alright guys, the last figure I got for Christmas, my girlfriend got this for me, and I'm actually really happy she did, because I showed her this like a, f a month ago, I believe, and she actually got it for me. It is the NECA Reactor Glow Godzilla. Yeah, it's really awesome, I love this figure. I've wanted this figure ever since it came out. On eBay guys, I actually almost got this like earlier in the year around April on a bid auction, but I lost that auction. So I don't know why I never went for it again. Getting it for Christmas was memorable because it was for my girlfriend. It's make, it makes it more special. I'm actually glad she got it for me. This is a really cool figure. Here's the box. Glows in the dark, loot crate, reactor glow Godzilla. And here's the back of the box. And thanks to my girlfriend, I have all 10 six inch NECA Godzilla figures. So I'll put that right there. Why not? Let me just show off the clothes and stuff like that. Here's one of the shirts I got from, I think it was one of my cousins. Really nice shirt. I like it. And my sister got me a Pennywise shirt. Yeah, this is the original Pennywise. 
Don't you want a balloon? Really nice shirt. Well, I like this shirt. Very nice sweater. And this is another gift from my girlfriend. She got me the Pennywise 2017 shirt. Yeah, the new Pennywise. A really, really nice shirt. Thank you. This right here, guys, is a backpack. Not just a backpack, it's a really cool backpack, to be honest. So, this is how it opens. You can zip it up. It's like a normal backpack, but it opens up wider than a normal backpack. The thing about this backpack is, is that it's waterproof. It has a charge, like an energy charger that you can charge your phone in while you have your backpack on. And you can charge a computer or anything that you have. You can just charge it in this backpack. This was a gift from my girlfriend and my girlfriend's mom. So... That's really nice. And here's the Gashafon set my girlfriend gave me, yeah. Um, really cool, I guess. I guess I got doubles now. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I hope you guys got what you wanted. If not, hey, there's always next year. There's always G-Fest as well. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Guys, we're almost to 20,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. I wanted that to be my end of the year goal. We're almost there, guys. I love you guys so much. So... Hope you guys enjoyed this. These figures are awesome. Thank you to my girlfriend. Thank you so much. My dad and my everyone that got me gifts. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Remember to subscribe, like, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys in the next video.